Chewy! We're supposed to be halfway to Naboo for a sweet party right now. This hyperdrive keeps malfunctioning, taking us to loser systems like this. Droid's right. Let's roll. Lake electron alchemy I've devised. Though my early test failed to retain cohesion and suffered bipolar reversion, I found that I could saturate the nucleopeptides with theta emissions and stabilize the dormant synaptic cell structure in its formative phase. It worked! But... Not well enough. Unfortunately, I overloaded the power matrix, causing a negative feedback pulse to discharge back through the frequency array and across Townsville, thus... And that's exactly what happened to us. I thought we'd put an end to Intergang last time. Okay, I can get there quicker. I'll see what's going on. It's a robot of some sort. At least I won't need to pull my punches. They're more like Interbots than Intergang. They aren't human, but highly advanced robots, and they pack a serious punch. I guess you don't know when to quit. I guess you're right. We'll just have to handle this ourselves. It's understandable. It must have been her memories of being the princess, rushing back and overloading her mind. No time to be impressed about that now. Let her go! Well, it is nice that all of you finally met. I need you to realize we're in the middle of an important investigation here. We'll share the details with you tomorrow night. Are you two okay? An internet man. If I'm not back in an hour, call the police. Oh, thank goodness you're okay! <laughs> I saw the spaceship start to leave and then it crashed and I came back and... Ugh, your eye. But you're okay! I'm supportive and very proud of you, and I'll be right back. <gasps> Gotta calm down. Where's my... Where's my relaxing music CD? Skits ...and recalibrated the timing belt. As long as you ease up on second gear, your transmission should be fine. Humans just lead short, boring, insignificant lives, so they make up stories to feel like they're a part of something bigger. They want to blame all the world's problems on some single enemy they can fight, instead of a complex network of interrelated forces beyond anyone's control. I hope you can forgive me. You're the one good thing that came out of this mess. I always thought you were proud of that. This sure doesn't feel like a reward. What do I have to lose? Great! Better than I have in weeks. I haven't had anything to eat or drink since the operation. Haven't wanted anything. Hey, wait a minute! I've had my own personal doctors examine both bodies. It appears Nala Say did miss something in her examination. I've admired your work unraveling supernatural mysteries for some time now. I mean, basically, we're in the same business of mystery and the occult, right? Not a single one. And I suspect that every alien species on Earth is represented in Undertown. Yes! I can't imagine that your collaboration with the Incursion Invasion helped your reputation very much. Once I charm the mermaid, my victory shall be complete. <laughs> Anyway, she's running against Richie for freshman class president. Only Richie thinks she's a bang baby and can turn people into brain puppets. Yeah? How about 22475? <laughs> That's my birthday. Pretty sneaky, but they can't fool your nose. And uh, no offense, old buddy, but I think your nose might be losing its touch. We've also donated the costumes of some of our more ridiculous foes, like Chickenstein. But who would be able to create a real pterodactyl ghost? Okay, I can work with this. <gasps> Sparkle Glitter Bomb Expand! Ah, that's better! I don't know, I just came out that way! Uh. I'm sorry, Marco. Uh, how about a little sunshine to brighten your day? Are you okay? Do you need any help? Ludo! How did you know I was here? Oh man, Mom, those are some sweet magic moves with your big ol' <clears throat> wings and stuff. I didn't get a choice about coming here to Earth, and you didn't get a choice about having to deal with me. I'll... I'll find another family to live with. 